Hey dear friends, welcome to part 6 of Node.js tutorial. In this episode, I will uh, I will show you how assertion test works in Node.js. So open your ID and start working with Node.js assertion test. I want to make uh, some object here const obj1 is equal to an object for example this object has an a with a value of b1 okay and then copy this I want to rename this object 2 and the B2 and object 3 with the same and also an object OBG4 is equal to object that create that credit object tree now you can test it okay I want to kill your terminal now not index now it doesn't have any result here as you can see here we have in, in the documentation as you can see here uh, at the first uh, it tested as deep equal object 1 and object 1 object 1 and object 2 object 1 with object 3 and object 1 with object 4 first you need to import the assert module const assert
so as you can see the object one and object three is equal now check object one with object four save as you can see it is not equal and this prints some assertion error this is object one and we take equal to object four okay also as you can see in the documentation object 1 with object 3 as you can see now it, they are equal but if I make this as you can see now it is equal all the we made this as a string because we are using dip equal if we use inside instead of dip, dip equal dip strict equal then it will not it will not uh, return true here is a problem as you can see as there, there is assertion error because this is this have value one but this is any string of value one okay also there is some another function which you can use in your application there is more function since here is assertion that does not true uh, that have two function okay assert is not defined yes sorry about that for assert um, assert as you can see there is wrong value why you call that is not true function and you pass a callback function uh, with this callback function return a true new type error and the second one is the second one parameter is syntax error okay does not true if you make this type error what will happen now there is again got unwanted exception type error okay syntax error also you can as you can see the, there is uh, well true the type error because there is no matching error type in the assertion okay now if you have this if you have this what will happen
as you can see there is something wrong with the strict equal So you can uh, you can draw a new type here. Okay, you can draw a new type here. That does not true. And clear this. Put in X. As you can see, here is some unwanted exception. But if I want to change this. can see now here is the error wrong value not a type error okay Now it returns the hopes as well. Uh, this was syntax error. Now it will return just the wrong value. So thank you for your watching and don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you in the next video. Goodbye.